I'm talking a little bit about the GROW project, a project that we implemented in northern Ghana for six and a half years. And we worked very closely with Amplio and their talking book. So the talking book made significant contributions to the lives of women in northern Ghana. The women that we worked with there are rural and most of them have very little education. They have limited access to information, especially technical information on agriculture. What we wanted to do is to make sure that they understood agriculture, health, education, land rights, and gender. With Talking Book, the women had access to a wide range of technical information whenever they wanted it. Oftentimes, women are unable to attend sessions for training because either they're working in their fields, they may be pregnant, they may have family obligations. With a Talking Book, it is a handheld teacher. And that handheld teacher can travel anywhere. It can go out to you if you want to get some water, it can go out with you to the field, can sit with you with your family, and all you do is press and listen. It allows you to reach anyone that you need to in a way that's not invasive. I think what the, why the talking book is so successful is because you can repeat the lesson again and again. And no one has to be embarrassed to ask the question, I didn't understand it, can you say it again? I didn't get that, can you say it again? That's the beauty of it because it doesn't judge you, it continues to play, it allows you to learn at your pace. In our area, we had nine different languages. Amplio can tell you which lessons were played again and again and again. From a data standpoint, what that does is our least listened message, what were we doing wrong? Immediately we'd know what was resonating, what wasn't. The talking book is anything you want to create it to be. Let's say that we want to add something new, a new nuance to our program. You don't have to change your program, you just have to put it into the talking book. So our women were finding they were getting cheated by middlemen. So what we did was give women negotiation skills. And part of that was in our talking book, having women hear how to negotiate, having back and forth conversations that they could listen to again and again. I mean, think about that. Women were able then to rip up contracts and say, nope, your price is too low. These women knew what their value was. They were able to ask for it. And when they weren't being met, they walked away. And if that's not an empowerment story for women, I don't know what else it is. We can say wholeheartedly that Talking Book has had a significant impact on gender equality in these communities and to the perception of women as experts. I think one of the biggest problems with all programs is you have to increase your reach. And I think that because money is always a huge issue and whether or not you can go further. And I think what the Talking Book does is amplify that reach.